private clinic. Okay, so the fact of the case is um, a late father had left a will uh, to his six sons. So he left uh, uh, eight parcels of land to be divided equally to all his sons. So each of them will get one per six each. So one day, uh, there was a dispute between the family members because of breach of family arrangement. So uh, the issue is still ongoing and did not settle yet. But uh, the appellant, one of the brothers, had put into caveat the whole land that was given by his, their late father. The appellant had put into caveat the whole land under section 323 of the NLC. By the respondents, the other brothers of the sons had applied to set aside the caveat and the high court allowed. So the appellant appealed, but the court of appeal had dismissed the appeal. Why? We can we'll explain later. So the issue is whether the caveat entered by the appellant was valid under section 323 of the National Land Code 1956. The judgment is uh, the court, the appeal court has dismissed the appeal made by the appellant because the private caveat, the caveat that entered by the appellant was in effect complying the requirement that stated under section 323 clause 1 of the National Land Code. In addition, the administration that left by uh, the late father was still incomplete. So, the value of the one six part uh, which every of the son uh, received was still uncertain. So, um, the, the caveat that entered by the appellate in the whole land was 